Hey folks, welcome back to ARC. Hey, I just wanted to say thanks for all the new follows. Getting that much closer to 500, like nine away. So thank you so much for sticking around, sticking with me, and hopefully enjoying the new, all the content. Um, really quickly, I wanted to show you we are going to take um, all the Rexes that have gotten, let's see, we're at three, three health mutations two melee and one one weight mutation we're going to take all them over with us to the island and um level them up and these were the ones that i was going to hold off on in case the mutations went random but no big deal and then i've got some dialing mutations but i'm going to wait and show you her when we get over there so we will see you over on the island in just a minute All right, we're back on the island. We've got our stuff. And the reason we're back on the island is because I've got this really good Ascendant Rex saddle. It's not, it's, it's good armor and it's not terrible uh, amount of materials. I mean, it's still a, a lot of materials, but it's not horrible. I've got my uh, Rex Athena. Let me show you what they ended up mutating out to. So they ended up coming out with, um, well, of course they're all imprinted now, but they ended up with three, um, three mutations in HP, um, one mutation in weight and two in melee, but this is what they're hundred percent imprinted to do. 1525 melee, 5,600 health. And then, I mean, the weight doesn't really matter, but yeah, this is what they look like at 958 is what they're all at level wise. Now, the colors aren't horrible either. They came out with a white body and this really cool blue stripe on top. I particularly like that. Glad that stayed. And then um, I think it's like a gray color there. Yeah, not, not too bad. Not too bad. I always name my, my female leader uh, is what I keep for a, uh, a Rex. I always end up naming her Athena. That's just what I've always done. I always like the uh, Greek god stuff, so I end up naming them after those. The Thyla, the, the red Thyla, after mutations and everything, I only got like one melee and one health, I think, and two stamina. Not that they needed it. This is what colors we ended up with them. Uh, let me see. Ended up with that teal body and then black stripe and then white underbelly, I think, or like an off-white, something like that. I have to see her in the, the uh, light. It's really not a bad color scheme. Maybe it's a cream for the belly. Might be a cream. I don't know. Not horrible, though. I like it. Ended up at 1,600 melee, 30, almost 3,500 stam, and then, or, uh, health and stam's, like, almost 6k. I mean, the stam is ridiculous. She doesn't need that much stamina. She'd have been fine with the 47, 4,800 that she had before. So, oh, lord. There we go. That's where I wanted you. Um, so, where we're headed... Is oops, me put my stuff back. We're headed up to Carno Island because we're just pretty much going to massacre Carno Island until the respawns are gone, and then um, then I'm going to head over to actually should should head up. Yeah, probably Carno Island. I'll take a break and head over to the volcano where all the stone and stuff, um, crystal and metal is. And grab all the crystal and metal. And, um, get all that because we need all the metal and all the hide. So, yeah, that's pretty much what it's going to be. 
leveling and crystal collection. Thyla is going to be good for the hide, and then we'll need to get all the levels on the Rexes. So, anyways, that's what it's going to be about this episode, pretty much. All those adventures, so... But, next biggest thing is to wait till daytime to do that. So, I'll be back in a bit when it's daytime. Okay, we're coming up here to Carno Island finally. Check like what it feels like ever to get up here. Goodness gracious. But we did come all the way from Red Ob to here, so. Let's be honest, it did take an hour to get up here. So, we're gonna test out Athena and see what her damage is like. I think probably. I should leave the other Rexus in here just just in case. And probably but the saddle be that went in there. Okay good. Let's see. So this one. Crap. Wow. Alright. Let's see what kind of damage you're doing. Imprinted, but not leveled yet. So base, not, uh, base imprinted damage, 823. It's not bad. Literally all we want is the hide, and then she can keep the uh, meat, of course, for healing. We'll keep those for the artifacts. Probably those. All right. Let's see how much do you get from one bump in HP? Okay, about three thousand. Get about thirty for every HP, for every melee. Okay. Let's see now. Oh yeah. Okay. So when you're not grouped up and there's somebody that's not covered. Wait a minute. Who's at 1300 on the one? Uh, okay. So you're not made boost, it's 1300. Yeah, that's much better damage.
take those, take that. Dude, what the heck? Okay, so let's go. I go a hundred thousand HP. Stuck. Oh, my God. oh, there we go. Rexes have a terrible turn radius. It's always been a thing, always will be. Oh, did not see you there. Fourteen hundred, not bad. Come on. Dang it, Burden. Oh no, 600 RG. Uh.
I think I'll leave some boxes real quick, I think. Put Athena away for now and pull out the Nyla. I wish I get a good look at her in the daylight. Ooh. No, man, no. Ugh. Done there. Okay. But yeah. She came out alright. Yeah. It's cream underneath. Definitely cream underneath. That's, of course, that's where you have the advantage of having a uh, Thyla that's 100% imprinted versus a non-imprinted. You get that speed buff. It makes it so worth it. I, I haven't given her any levels yet. No, I... Uh, what was she, 9? 942? I don't remember. She's gotten a couple of those, I'm sure. Pretty sure it's all been in melee. Hmm. I'd have to look. I'd have to look at my other one at the base and tell you. Tell you for sure what I got. I don't remember off the top of my head. No way. Ooh, that's a good dire bear saddle. Super nice, actually. Damn it, man. It's ridiculous to me. We've only been on a third of a short amount of time. We've already gotten more hide than we would have gotten on our uh than we've gotten on the Rex. Which is just awesome. Thyla is definitely the one to go to for hide. All right, well, it's going to be a bit of a shorter episode today, and I apologize for that, but, I mean, you get the gist of what we're doing here. We're just grinding for levels. Let's go ahead and give this to the Thyla. Um, yeah, but yeah, grinding for materials, grinding for levels. And, uh, let's start off with the, the uh, Thyla and uh, the, the Rexes. We need all the material for the Rex saddles for the boss army. 
this is going to be our boss army that takes us through the duration. Now we'll have to do a little bit of farming on um, Aberration to get that boss army done. We'll have to retain up back the um, <clears throat> Mega low oh gosh Yeah, the Megalosaurus. I I think maybe though. I still have those Megalosaurus saved, so I may not have to worry about those. But I, I think I'm not sure. Definitely gonna have to get Reapers though. I need a Reaper to ride into that fight, so I'm definitely gonna have to get that situated. I'm gonna have to get a Reaper trap built in a good location and get. Get some sort of reapers tamed up. I'm just gonna have to do that. We'll give you 50k and then the rest will just go into melee. Yeah. Let's see what kind of damage you're doing now. Flat thousand, and then it's just gonna get better from there, so. Come on, big boy. I have 20 Rexy. Ooh. All right, buddy. Sorry. Okay, let's get over to the raft and we'll get all this hide and stuff dropped off and we may stop there until everything respawns and take it right up to the uh, volcano and grab all the uh, <clears throat> stone and stuff that's up there and get it uh, stone the uh, um, metal and stuff that's up there and get it um get it smelting we need lots and lots of metal for all the uh saddles let's see how much do we actually need here um it is we need brought over nine of each and I've got one saddle on Athena already, so I need at least 17 more saddles. So, 200,000 hide, essentially. 300, and, oh no, 31, 31,000, 32,000 metal ingots. It's the 200,000 hide that's going to suck. And uh, 130,000 fiber, so, yeah. Anywho... That's where we're at for now. So, let me get this one put away. And I think here I'm just going to fly up to... Yeah, I'm just going to fly up there. Grab the metal. And then fly back here. There's no sense in... Uh, no sense in not doing that. I'm not going to take uh draft all the way up there. But, anywho. That's where we're going to be at for now. You guys have a good one. And I will see you next time. Thank you so much. Lord. Bye-bye.